There weren't many teams that could or did play with the 1972 National Championship USC team in any way. Stanford was the closest, losing by nine. But sometimes the elements have a way of making things closer than they otherwise would have been. Even though the day dawned bright and sunny and SC wore white in Eugene, Oregon that afternoon, it did not end up that way. And the elements helped the two teams combine for an astounding 14 turnovers. Certainly, the day belonged to the Trojan defense as they pestered this young Oregon quarterback. Do you recognize him? He looks like this today. Sure, it's Dan Fouts, and his offensive coordinator that day was future SC head coach John Robinson. Fouts had what they call an off day, finally picked off by Charles Hinton. After a scoreless first half, the skies opened up, pouring out nearly two inches of rain in two hours, thwarting Fouts' efforts even more. A sack by Jeff Winans. Intercepted by T. Parker. And while the Trojans couldn't do much generally, Anthony Davis sure could. Here's the first of his long game clinching TD runs. AD ended up rushing for over 200 yards. Sam Bam Cunningham added a one-yard touchdown run in the fourth quarter. Fouts got taken out, but his replacement didn't fare much better. Another Hinton pick. And this one by Tom Bollinger finished it off. The Trojans won 18-0 despite the elements, finishing up with wins over Wazoo, UCLA, and Notre Dame. A big triumph in the Rose Bowl over Ohio State cemented this Trojan team of 1972 as the greatest in college football history.